Justy Armentora. I'm a part-time program aide at the Maxwell Adult Center here in Deer Park. And today I am going to teach y'all how to make a face covering. I'm going to do the bandana one and Debbie will show you another option. Hi, I'm Debbie from the Maxwell Center. I'm a part-time program aide. And today I'll be showing you how to make another type of face covering using a sock. Okay, to make our first mask, you need a bandana or some fabric, a couple of hair ties, and if you want a filter, you can use a coffee filter. I've folded a coffee filter in half. And we have a pipe cleaner. Okay. Okay, to start, you'll lay your bandana out flat. Take one side and fold it about to the halfway mark there. Then do the same with the other side. Fold it about halfway. Now, I'm using a coffee filter. Some people don't put a coffee filter in, but if you want, you can put the coffee filter in. Just lay it like this flat. This is a pipe cleaner that I have folded in half. This is just if you want to form your mask to your nose. Some people don't use the pipe cleaner. Then we fold it over like so. Straighten it out. Then take your hair ties. Put one on this end. And another on this end. Like so. So this is what it's going to look like at this point. And then you just fold your ends in like so. You have your hair bands out here. And like so, you have a mask. So Debbie will do her masks now, and we will model them after she does hers and show you what they look like on your face. All right, for this tutorial, for this mask face covering, uh, all you'll need is a pair of scissors, a pair of socks, not a pair, some socks. Uh, it doesn't have to be ankle sock. It could be a tube sock, any kind of sock. And this is optional, uh, another coffee filter if you want that extra protection through your mask. All right, for this tutorial, for this mask face covering, uh, all you'll need is a pair of scissors, a pair of socks, not a pair, some socks. Uh, it doesn't have to be ankle sock. It could be a tube sock, any kind of sock. And this is optional, uh, another coffee filter if you want that extra protection through your mask. All right, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to open up this end of the sock. So we're just going to cut this little toe part out so it makes more of a rectangle. And then where the heel and the top of the sock meet, we're going to cut that. So we have basically an open tube. And we're going to make the part for the ears. So you're going to just about half an inch away from the edge, cut just a little over halfway through the sock, like that, on each side. So we're going to cut about halfway through. So this is what it's going to look like. And then you can open it up like this. And you'll, this will be for your ears, and this will be your face covering. I didn't do a very neat job. But at this point, you could add your coffee filter into your face covering if you'd like that extra bit of protection. All right. And so, that therefore, that is how you make a mask from a sock. Okay, and here are our finished masks. This is what the bandana mask looks like with the pipe cleaner. And this is the sock mask that I have on. Very simple to make, very easy. And I want to say we miss our seniors and we can't wait till everything gets back to normal. I agree with Miss Justy. We are so ready for everybody to get back at the Maxwell Center and life get back to normal as we knew it. And we're missing everybody and, and can't wait to See everybody once again. Thank you for watching.